Now the question is number of such continuous functions which is defined from R to R in such a way that the functional equation satisfies then the functional equation is f of x plus f of 2x is equal to 0. So here I can write this as f of 2x is equal to negative times of f of x. Now let's do one thing here let's replace x by x by 2 here because this functional equation is valid for all x belongs to R. Now if we do this we'll get this as f of x is equal to negative times of f of x by 2 here. Now again we do the same thing replacing by x by x by 2 because I can do this because it's valid for x belongs to R. If you do that you will get this as f of x by 2 is equal to negative times of f of x by 4 and this goes on and the sequence will go on till the last term. If I put x by again if I replace x by x by 2 I'll get this as f of x let's say f of 2x will be equal to minus times of f of x is equal to plus times of f of x by 2 is equal to negative times of f of x by 4 is equal to positive times of f of x by 8 the negative times of f of x by 16 and this sequence will go on and last term will be let's say plus or minus f of x upon 2 raised to power n now here the last term for a last term n is tending towards infinity if n is tending towards infinity i can write this as f of x as f of 0 here now f of 0 i'm going to calculate from functional value okay so functional value will be if you put x is equal to 0 here from the functional equation f of 0 plus f of 0 will be equal to 0 this implies f of 0 is equal to 0 and here if you get plus or minus it does not matter because we'll get f of x is equal to 0 there's only one kind of function which is possible here and that is f of x is equal to 0 a constant function and that'll be all